One interesting question is whether or not adults should modify their diet in order to increase their levels of focus if they're already having normal levels of focus but would like more or would like to reduce existing adult ADHD. That's an interesting and even more controversial topic. It brings us right into the realm of what are called omega-3 fatty acids. I've talked many times on this podcast about the known benefits of omega-3 fatty acids, in particular, it getting a one gram, 1,000 milligrams or more, even as much as 2,000 milligrams each day of the so-called EPA component of omega-3 fatty acids, known to have antidepressant effects, mood elevating effects, known to have important effects protecting the cardiovascular system. I think it's now clear that the immune system also benefits that omega-3 fatty acids that include a gram or more of EPAs are very beneficial. Typically that's done through fish oil, 